no glory mister that is I am coming to you with a long overdue cooking video so I am going to make let me show you everything I am going to make some shrimp scampi but of course I'm going to do it my way I always spice it up or spiff it up a different kind of way so I'm starting with the uh, Campbell's the sauces shrimp scampi and it shows it just you can either have it straight up like an olive or like at a red lobster or whatever or you can have it over noodles so what I'm going to do instead of just straight noodles I'm going to put it over some pasta romi butter and garlic noodles okay so that's what I'm going to put it over and of course I'm going to spice it up a little more. I, we like just a little more spice to it. So I'm going to add a little bit of adobo. And I've got four cloves of garlic, four little cloves out of a head of garlic that I'm going to mince up in my garlic mincer. And when you do that, you just, you know, you twist it. And so these are pretty good. I'll do that when I start cooking. And start off with a one pound of the nice big shrimp okay the large shrimp one pound of those this is what it looks like in my skillet and it says to add a tablespoon of oil which I added a little more than that with of olive oil and it doesn't call for any butter, but guess what I did? Yep, I put some butter in there. So, like I said, I do a little bit different. You don't have to do it that way. You can do it straight like what the box says, and you can do just straight noodles instead of, you know, a garlic butter noodle, whatever you want to do. You can do it that way. And it doesn't call for the garlic either, but I like garlic. So, I'm going to put the garlic in and I'm going to start cooking. It also tells you on the bag to cook the shrimp first, get them a little bit pink and then put them in and uh, get it started to cook and get it, bring it to a boil and then bring it down to a simmer. I'm going to bring it to a boil and then put my shrimp in. I do it a little bit different. You can do it there again as the instructions say or however you like. But that's how I'm doing it. So we'll be back with the finished product. See you later. Okay, guys, we are back. This is here. This is the sauce. The uh, Campbell's sauce skillet. And this is the shrimp scampi. And as you can see, that's the sauce there. Now he's added... I don't know if you can see it in there or not, but he's added a, a bunch, bunch of, of garlic. A bunch of minced garlic. You can kind of see it all in there. He minced up about four cloves or so of of garlic, and now he is putting in the sh he put in the shrimp. So we're going to sauté that for a little bit here. You can already see him starting to turn pink a little bit. And then over here, I have the water and stuff boiling here and getting ready to do the noodles so I'll be back in just a few to show you the rest of it hey guys we're back okay this is what the shrimp scampi looks like it's all done there in the garlic sauce now like we said we use the package of the Campbell's sauce scampi sauce and then we added some garlic and we added some adobo which is just an all seasoning but you can add whatever you want now here the noodles are all done and this is the noodles that we had used the pasta roni and it's the butter and garlic so now he's gonna go ahead and plate this up and we'll be back in just a moment all right we're back with my concoction of some sort almost this is the shrimp scampi and I had to get the uh, food critic to try it so this it is looks, what it looks amazing it smells awesome so let's go ahead and give this a little try here
That's good. And of course, I've got to get a shrimp. That's right. Try that shrimp. Oh, yeah. That is awesome. <laughs> mm -hmm. Score another one for Mr. That Is. That is amazing. Now, if you like garlic, it's really garlicky. We're all going to stink to high heaven. Yep, garlic, I love my garlic. But don't care. But you got to give this recipe a try. It's amazing. It's, yeah, it's really, really good. So, hope you guys enjoyed this video. And give this recipe a whirl. And we'll see you in the next one. Remember to always let go like God. No guts on glory. And Mr. That Is. Bye, guys. See ya.